Hello guys, welcome to the online attitudes.com. My name is Asif Ali. In this video, I'm going to show you how we can create crystal report with the help of C Shop and SQL Server. So I have the uh, design, the simple uh, form, and uh, include the button and grid view. And also I have load the data from uh, database on grid view so i run the project and here you can see it, the three records display on um, grid view right and this is my database a tutorial and this is a table uh, named t student tbl and here is a three records available in this table so this table records i have included on here right uh, three records available on grid view so I want to generate the report uh, with the help of on click this button right so first of all I just double click on this button to generate the event and here is a simple code to display the SQL server data in grid view why this is a very simple process to display the grid view uh, the data display on grid view but I want to generate the crystal report so I double click on button and to generate the event so the next step is the first step is you need to generate the event then the next step is you need to uh, go on uh, solution explorer I have already tried the crystal report so I remove the crystal reports options and also this option right and also this option and basically I have used the methods so I will uh, tell you step by step how you can create the crystal report the first step is you need to uh, generate the event the next step is you need to right click on solution explorer project and go to add new item select window form application insert the phone name for example cr view this is my form name and click ok and then go to toolbox and search crystal report view drag and drop the crystal report view here right then go to the event portion and call this form on click to button event then uh, the call crystal view this form so I generate the simple code to create the first uh, object ob dot show this dot height so this is a very simple process I just close the link here and uh, run the project to check the event I click to button and here crystal reports viewer is calling as well so the next step is you need to go on solution explorer right click here add new item and select data data set and enter the data set name but I use default right then click to add button and the next step you need to go on server explorer Oh, sorry data source I check the sorry server explorer to create the connection while right click on data connection add new connection enter the server name go to a SQL server and uh, click to connection button or connect button here and copy the server name on SQL server 
and go to the connection portion paste here select the database my database name is tutorial and select this ok the database is uh, uh, available to get the data I click arrow sign tables here this is uh, my table student TBL I just select this table and drag and drop here right this is uh, my table name and I simple drag and drop here and then close this and control plus s to save the project and close the data set the next step you need to go on solution explorer right click here add new item and go to reporting crystal report into the crystal report name or and click add button now you need to select the uh, template or design I just uh, use the default next and then you need to create the connection go to on uh, below and uh, select OLADB ADO connection and plus plus sign to create the connection go on the below and select the Microsoft OLDB provider for secure server next enter the server name go to secure server copy the server name and uh, where is uh, I just call the here is a uh, connection portion paste the server name and check mark the integrated security and then select the database tutorial select next finish after the creating connection then you need to uh, select the database and database table and table name this is my table name I just select this table and click to greater than sign it means move to table on this portion to this portion and select click to next button now move all columns here just click on it finish sorry next and finish and then you need to add the database as the crystal reports has uh, completed but you need to go on form 1 sorry crystal view form portion and click on this sign and choose the crystal report viewer select the crystal report and then ok that's it there are very simple process and control s to save the project close the all files let's check to the reports option I click event and here is our reports generated as well if you want to change the uh, column name size you need to go on the crystal report options I stop this project and go to my uh, crystal report and then you need to uh, uh, the write the um, title and many other things you need to write click on here and set the text object and then write student registration form right and then where are student data and select the size here size and uh, font size many other things available on here you can select any portion and the font size and line break 
so you can do it as well there are very simple process to so or uh, you can uh, add the text uh, uh, size and um, font size and uh, style uh, you can uh, just click on the fonts and selection portion and go to uh, size or font design and then select the size and uh, increase the size of the selection portion like this and then I just move the okay I think that's very nice and then do you want to write avoid the line so you need to go on design uh, reporting uh, I think uh, insert the insert portion line and into the line like uh, and then I just write again and uh, line and then I enter the line on above section right and I use the uh, print that on the above section move online here that great save the file and then I just copy the line and then copy and paste line and uh, here save uh, run the project and print and then here you can see it that's looking so nice so you can use many options to design the crystal reports as well there are few uh, the steps to complete the generate the report with the help of C shop and CQ server and then you have installed crystal report you have installed crystal report then you can use this method to generate the report as well otherwise you need to download and install crystal report then you will be able to generate the crystal report thank you very much for watching see you in next video or lecture